<laughs> hello my beautiful people how are you guys doing i hope you guys are great welcome back to my youtube channel in case you're new here this is florence ogutu and you are so welcome in this channel please subscribe so that you can be part of this amazing family mm -hmm. and if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much mwah, mwah, mwah. i don't take your support for granted please continue supporting me continue sharing my videos continue liking them continue commenting i your girl is so 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 thankful yes so today guys today i'm going to show you my house uh -huh, i'm going to do a bed sitter or a studio tour apartment tour so yes that is what this video is all about and a disclaimer guys i'm a student yes i don't have a lot of stuff in my house so i'm just going to show you what i have uh, at the moment but then i also did this video because I'm planning to buy a lot of stuff of course i'm manifesting a lot of stuff uh for this house and so like i want to update you guys on everything that i'll buy later on so i'm doing this video with what i have right now i'm going to show you what i have right now and then i'll keep on sharing the videos of everything i'll buy later on so please 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 comment down below and um tell me what you love and what you'd like me to add what you don't like 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 what you don't like in the house or like i'd want to know what you don't like so you can also tell me what you don't like in the house so guys before we start the video there are some things that i'd love to share with you and these are things that i've come to learn while staying alone yes and um one very important thing while staying alone or while staying in a bed sitter or a small space please ensure you're so organized like just be organized don't be messy you know like keeping things everywhere maybe your clothes are in the living room like your clothes are found in the uh, in the kitchen no or your sufurias in the living room area you don't want that trust me ensure you're organized because this is a small space everything needs to be in place i don't know if you get me everything just needs to be in place like if it's the bedroom stuff they need to stay in the bedroom area if it's the living room stuff they need to stay in the living room area because this is a small space and if it's messy trust me when a bed sitter becomes messy it looks it looks awful yeah just ensure that you're so organized and clean yes so let's get into the video so guys this is my door yes i'm standing right at the door and i don't have curtains uh placed at the door because i'm not a curtains at the door person yes but then i love these apartments because they placed uh translucent panes or glasses yeah the door. so they don't allow people on the outside to see whatever is going on and yeah actually that's one of the reasons why i didn't see the need of placing curtains at the door so guys immediately after the door on my right hand side there is this uh cream stool a water bottle and a pump that i use for my drinking water i didn't have money to purchase a water dispenser so i decided to go with the pump but it's working perfectly for me so i'm going to keep it for a while yes and then on the wall i have this car hook and my padlock plus the keys i place them there during the day and on the same wall i have this butterfly stickers that i use to decorate my wall they are giving kind of a baby baby girl vibe but i stay alone so i can do anything i want with my house yes and then i have this curtains that i love so much i got them from a curtain shop in rongai and to be honest guys i really love them i love the texture i love the pattern i just love everything about my curtains yes and they are so affordable i think they were going for um 2400 shillings yeah like the whole set without the um the shears of course i got the shears from uh, a thrift shop at 400 shillings which was so affordable compared to buying them from the curtain shop yes and they work perfectly for me like the person uh, someone who's 
outside cannot see whatever is going on in the inside so i love them and this is just another pair from the curtain and um yeah some butterflies on this side so guys still on this side i have my study area and uh it's just this simple i don't have a lot of stuff here it's just to make a chair and my table that i got from a second hand shop yes and on this table there is nothing much going on i just have my book my um uh, how is it called serviette dispenser yeah i i keep my serviettes in there so i think it's a serviette dispenser and this cup plastic thing that i used to keep my pens and uh, on this side i have this water bottle that i i keep water inside so that i can drink like whenever i feel thirsty i just drink the water and these are just some meds that i got from the hospital uh this week i was so sick but now um yeah my health is improving and i thank god i haven't i'm still so far from finishing the doors so uh they're gonna stay there for a while so guys immediately after the the table i have this seat that i got from home and i really love it yes my sister gave it to me and uh, on the seat since i don't use it most of the time i use it to keep my the kamasai shuka and that throw blanket that i use during extreme cold seasons like right now yeah uh-huh and then on that cowl i have this how is it called uh token box ilia rebika but it's still working and i have this ring light that i use uh while recording my videos especially the recipe videos and talks so guys that is all for the study area let me give you a short video of how it looks so guys moving on to the living room area i have this tv stand that i love so much it just makes my house look good the details the color i love it uh guys i don't have a tv yet but i have this laptop that i use for studying as well as entertainment and now i'm using it to listen to r b yes on this side i have that coming in three point stand and on this side i have an airwick that i use to keep my house fresh smelling good yes and below it i have the cabal with candies this is just a a box that came with the ring light i have my remote my systems yeah and the extension and in these drawers i have a lot of important stuff that i'm not gonna show you actually there is not much but yeah i just use it to keep some of my stuff so that is all for this tv stand i also got it from a second hand shop guys most of the things in this house were bought in a second hand shop because they're affordable so still on the living room area i have this carpet that i also got from a second hand shop yeah and i really love it i love the color i love the texture it's so smooth it's so smooth and it makes my house warm and just look pretty and then on this side i have my couch it's a two-seater couch and i really love it the person that made this for me did a really great job and i love love it yes i'd really recommend so if you're in machacos and you want a couch i leave his number uh, on the description box so this uh seat it doesn't have a lot of stuff going on there is just this cutthroat pillow a pink one that i used to decorate it and this throw how is it called throw blanket i'm so tired and this throw blanket that i got from think twice i think it was only 300 shillings guys if you want good stuff i'd recommend you guys to go um 
to think twice they're really affordable they have good stuff yes okay guys so let me give you a short review of how the living room looks like so guys that is it for the living room um go i'm now going to show you my bedroom area and the first thing when you see that you'll find in my bedroom yes of course it's my bedroom the first thing that you'll find in my bedroom is this car wicker wicker basket yeah i think yeah it's called wicker basket that i got from rongai it was quite expensive but i love love it i use it to keep um my inners socks bras you know yeah and on top of it i have those two love Mm, pillows that i got from think twice i think they were only 50 bob yeah i just placed them there because i didn't have anywhere else to place them i didn't want them on my bed so they look cuter there and then guys immediately after the kawika basket is my bed that i love so much i haven't decorated it much but then i just love everything about it the color i love bright colors i don't know if you guys have noticed and fuzz you know even my <laughs> my pillowcases fuzz. yeah so i just love my bed and it's small for me enough for me yes <laughs> yeah and i love it so much i love the white I, I wanted a white bed i've always wanted a white bed and the carpenter did exactly what i told him to so yes guys that is my bedroom area not so much going on mm -hmm. then guys immediately after the bed is this shoe rack it was so huge i didn't have anywhere else to place it so i decided to put it here and it it looks good yeah i use it to keep all my shoes i have a lot of shoes and the funny thing is i never have places to go so sad so yeah those are my shoes and the shoe rack so this is still the bedroom area yeah not the kitchen the bedroom area and uh-huh when you turn to this other side i have my custom made closet if that's a word my custom made closet that i brought from home and it serves me it serves me like i really love it i really like this house didn't have a closet so i decided to go with this and it just makes my house look organized you know our clothes are not just placed everywhere and i've neatly organized my clothes according to you know jeans sweaters dresses tops yeah so that whenever i want this type of cloth i just get it without disarranging the whole thing and on top of it i have my bags i don't have a lot of bags but i don't even travel anyway <laughs> so those are enough for me yes so that is all for the bedroom area i didn't have a place to put this i don't know if it's in the living room or bedroom area but okay I think you go to my legal sour. <laughs> yes. So guys, we are moving on to the kitchen area. And Chatuni say me line. No na line. line. It's dividing the bedroom area from the kitchen area. So and <laughs> So the first thing that you're going to see when you enter my kitchen is this wicker stand. That I use to keep my spices. That are just uh, those are just my spices, and then on the second basket I use it to keep my tomatoes and fruits, and on this one I use it to keep my onions and waros, yeah, Irish potatoes. So it's a very very important thing in this kitchen, yeah. And then right after the stand, I have my drum. That I use to store water because these are uh, the apartments don't have 
consistent supply of water so during shortage i use the water stored in the drum and then on top of it an easy two basins and the jug and then after the drum is this my cooker is it cooker hey meko gas cylinder <laughs> yeah i have this gas cylinder and um the carblax tool yeah this is my cooking area this is the place where i cook and give you guys my sweet recipes yes <laughs> and then right after guys my phone in asumbua so you guys will have to bear with me today so right after the cylinder i have this table that was made for me and it really comes in handy i love love it yeah and in any carpet show on zile plastic carpets i placed it on top ju every time i realized niki ilikuwa inatoa rangi niki niki panguza yeah so on top of it I've, i use it to place my blender water heater you need so daily baki and those are my cakes then you see my kukula and then it is actually divided into two is it three yeah the first portion second and then the third so three portions now the second one natumia kuweka mayai uh this mutter and pestle and yoni mafta ya kupika inini mesto and then chini ni make us furia vifuniko and the tray yeah so that is how important this table is and then right after the table there is this bucket that i used to put utensils after washing because i don't have a dish rack yes i don't have a dish rack yet so i put the utensils there and then wipe them and then this this is my washing area this is the place where i wash my dishes yeah and it's clean those are just the vitambas i use to wipe the area wipe dirty places and those are my washing materials morning fresh yeah and then on on the wall like uh on top of the sink on the wall ni make uh, my chopping board and that cup plastic that i used to wash my rice and on this other side i have these uh huh how are they called towels kitchen towels um, i don't know how to call them i use them to wipe my dishes after washing them this is just uh this cup black thing is i use it to heat my water ni ile nyenye kachini ukiheat your water so nimeye kapo uh huh and then that is my pan that i love so so much i got it from kamkunji so yes and then on top like on this wall i have this cardboard that was placed here and i use it to place my cereals and all the other stuff that i use that i need in my kitchen so on top of it i have mafuta yenye natumia my vegetable oil rice cooking flour green grams and a lot a lot of stuff guys you guys can see whatever i have there yes and then this these are just my how is this supposed to be called kitchen gowns samani nini i use them while cooking or while washing dishes kama stacking wish afuke yes so that is it guys i forgot to show you uh whatever was going on here so this wall ni make those hooks i use them to put my mikos vijiko whisk and these other kitchen towels zenye natumianga mostly nikipika you know when you wash your hands while cooking and you have to wipe them yes and then on top of this mm -hmm. and then on top on the wall there is this uh cabinet that i love so much it comes in handy i use there is you know the closed side na kuna side imebaki kama imefunguliwa so i use it to 
uh -huh, down here i use it to keep my plates and my glasses and then ukoju you guys can see i use it for my glasses that ka plastic ha huh? okay kuna vitu mingi hapa kuna thermos kuna ka plastic tin that i use to carry food while going to school kuna that ka is it blue or green natumia kwa kama mwiko nini nini rolling pin yeah and then ukoju that's the light kuna vibuyu niko natumia kwa maji kitambo since i don't buy like 5 liters nowadays i decided to put them there there is that extra dishwash i don't know if you guys can see it yeah nothing much but then on the open side tani wafungulia muone on the closed side i mean nothing much going on just my house shopping like i did i did house shopping recently that's why that's why bado kuna vitu like in next week hmm so those are the snacks the things i eat while in the house yes guys that's all for my kitchen and let me give you a short review of the kitchen So ukitoka kwa jikoni unakuja unakuja kuna bedroom living room area place ni meka manguo unatembea 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 ukikuja unakutana na hii mlango ni hii ama ni huu yeah the door you find the door this is the door to my bathroom i'm not going to show you the bathroom today guys it's i don't love my bathroom i don't love the walls i don't love the floor nothing Yes and you guys might be wondering mafuta ni make up ni makeups nini nini most of them ziko kwa bathroom yeah kuna mali ni nilipata ni, ni, imetengenezwa i can place them there so on the bathroom i can just show you this and the door is really bad by the way that can just show you how it looks i can show you this this is my mat that i really love so soft my slippers that i use for the bathroom it's a bathroom slash toilet so kuna cho na bathroom dani and then kando kuna that peg stuff i use it to keep my pegs and then i have my basins and my laundry basket that i use to keep dirty clothes and then on top of that on the wall i have my towel and my gown yeah so that's all and then the door yeah so you guys like i try to keep you know the bathroom stuff on the bathroom side uh the living room stuff the living room stuff on the living room side study stuff study area which is a bedroom kwa bedroom which is a jikoni kwa jikoni so that's all for my house guys i hope you love the video i hope you enjoyed it nime record kama nime choka ah yes so I hope you guys bear with my bear with my voice.